Okay, the final scenario for this uh, ratio is when you have an uh, increase on one side while decreased by another side by its different amount. Okay, that means uh, one side of the ratio increase while other side decrease and the amount are both different. Okay, so how do we tackle this type question? Okay, so the ratio of uh, Derek's money to Jack's money was 2 is to 1. Okay, so I've already drawn a model over here. Derry is uh, 2 units while Jerry is uh, 1 unit. Okay. After Derry spent an uh, uh sorry save uh, save means the Derry's money increase all right by sixty dollar and Jerry spend one fifty okay spend means the money will decrease for Jerry the ratio become uh, became four is to one and how much money did Jerry have at first okay so when uh Derry save sixty dollar all right so this is you must uh we should we should, we should use a bone line over here right because it's increase. Okay, so there is save city dollar while Jerry spend 150. Okay, the mean this part here is gone already. Okay, while Derek have additional part over here. The ratio becomes 4 is to 1. Okay, so it is in this type of question, right? It's very useful to apply a method called cutting of model. Right? I want to cut the model up. Okay, so in this case, when I cut this one unit apart, right, I want to separate, I want to cut with this part over here. I must do the same thing for the other two units over here. Okay, so you simply just uh, cut this unit by 150. You also cut this unit by 150, right? You must do the same thing, right? Okay, and then this ratio, the final ratio is 4 to 1, right? So that means this will be one unit, okay, because this is remaining, okay, while for Derek from here. All the way to over here, okay, is four units. Okay, make sense? Okay, from here all the way to over here is four units. Alright? And since you know that it's one unit, okay, the means from here to here is three units. Okay, four minus one is three, right? From here to here is three units. Okay, then we also know that this. This one unit here right, is the same as this one unit here, right? Okay, that means in other words, the difference when we take three minus one, we get two units. Will represent this plus this plus this. Okay, so you simply take one fifty plus another one fifty plus sixty. Okay, you get three sixty, and this and this three sixty represent two units. Okay, because you take this the whole the whole length minus with the one unit over here. Okay, so two units will represent three sixty, and one unit will represent one eighty. Okay, so uh, our job is to find how much money Derry did Derry have at first. So Derry originally had this amount without a sixty dollar. All right, so you you find two units which is 360, then you plus another 300. Okay, so you take 360 plus 300, and the final amount will be six. All right, six six zero. Okay, so this will be the final amount of money that Derek have at first.